welcome back to my cosy corner of the internet. I'm Maya Star. I teach energy healing courses online through Maya Star Academy. Create music as a Lemurian priestess and provide healing, ritual and spell casting services as a star seeded shaman and professional witch. And here I select a tarot deck each week from my extensive collection to elucidate the ethers and scry the shifting celestial tides on behalf of the collective. These readings are not aimed at any particular person and you are meant to find them at the time their guidance is most relevant to you. So please take only what resonates with you and leave the rest behind. My musings are intended to inspire, uplift and guide you on your healing journey. Find out about the different ways you can work with me or join the Maya Star mailing list by visiting my website at myastar.net. My latest channeled music backs this video. Listen to the end to hear more about this sacred recording and to hear about all the latest Maya Star news. This week's news includes special offers for the specific application spell package and the chakra healing attunements course. But before we get to that, let's start with this week's energy update, where we will be looking at the dominant energetic influences and the opportunities they're creating for us now. We will cover the potential for energetic opposition and explore ways we can circumvent problems or mitigate challenges. And finally, I'll draw daily cards with guidance and law of attraction affirmations that you can use to align with the current energetic landscape and enhance your positive mindset. I've chosen the Wild Unknown Tarot for our etheric explorations today. This is a nature-based deck and usually one I reach for in autumn. But lately I've been working with the Lightworker Animal Empowerment System as part of my personal ritual practice. And this deck includes many trees and animal characters that express some of the wilder aspects of the traditional archetypes. I also enjoy the paper-like finish of these cards. It makes them easier to work with in low light conditions like during a ritual. I'm sure this deck will be a powerful translator of the numinous forest today. So sit back, relax your shoulders, take a sip of chamomile tea, exhale deeply and let's explore. The dominant energetic influence we can tap into over the coming week for the purpose of progressing the spiritual journey and pursuing the path to wholeness is reflected in the Ace of Pentacles. In this position, positive attributes of the card are emphasized and indicate opportunities for manifesting wealth and abundance in all areas. Wealth and abundance are often equated with financial prosperity but in fact, true wealth and abundance includes fulfillment in many areas, including personal happiness, relationships, and having the opportunities for growth in your life. The Ace of Pentacles is like a seed ready to germinate and express its divine potential. Aligning with this archetype this week means recognizing that you can grow evolve and flourish when you allow your divinity to shine. Be open to the idea that you already possess the power needed to exceed yourself this week. The second card identifies the potential opposition we may face in pursuit of the promises of the first card. And this week, this comes in the form of the Nine of Wands. This isn't a negative card, but in this position, we're dealing with the shadowed aspect of the archetype. 
the presence of this card warns us that fear or rigidity could block us from recognizing the demonstrations of abundance around us this week. If you notice your thoughts seem more aligned with the past than with the future, set aside some time for meditation, relaxation and consideration to get yourself back on track. If you draw all of your beliefs, feelings and thoughts from the past, then your future will be a recreation of the past. That's not your goal, it's time to recalibrate. And now we turn to the daily cards for the week ahead. These cards depict and define the archetypal energetic influences we can harness. To optimize our personal power, and increase our inspiration in the coming days. Monday, Five of Wands. Dodge the drama and cut off from the conflict today by staying in your lane and prioritizing your inner peace. Your time is precious and not everyone that demands it is deserving of it. Be discerning. The universe reminds you that Conflict requires your participation. Affirm, I am aligned with positive and progressive change. Tuesday, Eight of Pentacles. Channel your energy into developing skills to find your grounding today. Artistic projects offer opportunities for spiritual expression. Your inner light can be shared with the world through your creativity. The universe reminds you that every act of will is an act of magic. Affirm. My heart is open to the magical and miraculous. Wednesday. Page of Swords. Where you place your attention, you place your power. Rise above fear and limitation by opening your mind to new possibilities. The universe reminds you that every day brings you closer to happiness when you choose the words and ways that align with your soul. Affirm, I dance towards my divine destiny. Thursday, Four of Pentacles. Hold on to your power by being careful where you put your energy. Protecting yourself from gossip, drama and negativity is an important part of self-care. The universe reminds you that keeping healthy boundaries is part of love. Affirm, I pursue the path of healing and wholeness, one step at a time. Friday, the Emperor, you have the power to make things happen. You're in the driving seat of your life and today's your day for getting things done. Stay in your lane so that distractions don't dampen your determination. The universe reminds you that discipline and doggedness demonstrate your dominance. Affirm, sovereignty is my strength, success is my story. Saturday, the star, look up. Celestial bodies are aligned in your favour and encouraging you to make a soul felt wish today. Fortune favours the free and fabulous, so choose to shine like the star you are. The universe reminds you that nothing can dim the light that shines from within. Affirm, mine is the light of limitless love. Sunday Queen of Wands. Your confidence shines today. Pursue your passions with style and a winning smile. Don't be afraid to do things differently. The universe reminds you that it falls in love with a stubborn heart. Be uncompromising and keep progressing your path with positivity. Affirm. Everything I touch turns to gold. This concludes our mystical musings for the week ahead and brings us to the Maya Star News.
This reading was drawn for the week commencing the 13th of May 2024, but these words are meant for you whenever you found them, and I hope they brought you inspiration on your path. In today's Maya Star News, I want to tell you about my latest channeled meditation music and the latest special offers and updates. This week's special offers are for the Chakra Healing Attunements course and the Triple Spell Package. Starting with the Triple Spell Package, this option can be found on the Maya Magical website and allows you to choose from a range of 30 different spells to create a personalised package that suits you and addresses your goals. There are spells for protection, love, reversal of negative energy, healing, hex breaking, psychic development, good fortune and much more. Newsletter subscribers can receive an additional discount this week and if you need advice on the best spells for your situation, Email me through the website and I'll be happy to discuss the options with you. And now we'll look at the Chakra Healing Attunements course, a simple but powerful energy healing technique that works to balance the energy of each of the main energy centers of the light body. It's a great foundation for new energy workers too learning the correspondences and characteristics of different energies that make up the energy body can help you to intuitively understand how to interpret your impressions of the energy field and fine-tune your healing practice. Here's some more information about this course from the Maya Star website. The first chakra connects with our physical well-being survival, security and grounding. The second deals with our emotions, sexuality and creativity. The third deals with our energy protection and boundaries. It enhances our independence and energetic integrity, as well as boosting our confidence. The fourth chakra relates to the heart center and is concerned with our emotions and our capacity to give and receive love. The fifth chakra connects with the voice and communication of all kinds. It can also assist in developing our ability to channel by allowing us to express the downloads of information we receive in a way that can be understood. The sixth chakra connects with the third eye which facilitates our intuition and psychic abilities, enabling us to develop our spiritual gifts and sensitivity. The seventh chakra connects with the crown and it represents our connection to the higher self, our divinity, and allows us to awaken to Christ consciousness. It can also help us to connect with the light beings that support us in our spiritual awakening journey. You can find more information about this course on the Maya Star website and you can also find a Maya Star energy healing article all about chakra energy on this channel or podcast to dive a bit deeper into the subject. If you feel drawn to pursue your spiritual path or progress your healing journey with energy work, You can buy the Chakra Healing Attunements course and over a hundred more attunement based energy healing courses on the Myastar website at myastar.net. I provide individual support by email for all students and personally prepare all attunements using the Orb of Life method which allows my students to receive them wherever they are in the world. This week's meditation music is called Unwind Your Mind in a Lemurian Dream Pop Reverie. This track includes a Lemurian rune song with light codes to encourage inner peace and relaxation. It can be a great meditation for listening to during your downtime and healing sessions. 
There are four versions of this track available for you to choose from, including the Light Language Mantra Mix, a Sound Bath Dreamscape Mix, and ambient versions with ocean waves and thunder drum sounds. Check out all of the mixes on your favourite music app. And if you want to support my work, you can also buy Maya Star Music from Amazon or iTunes. I will leave this playing for the next 5 minutes at the end of this video to afford you a moment of respite and relaxation. But before that, I'd like to thank you for spending some time with me today. I hope you're leaving this video suffused with good vibes and great ideas. On this channel I share my week ahead spiritual guidance and mystical musings for the collective, meditation soundscapes and energy healing articles to inspire and uplift you on your spiritual path. You can find a collection of Maya Star Energy Healing articles that cover a variety of spiritual, new age and star seeded topics on this channel, as well as on the Maya Star website at mayastar.net. I provide inspiring spiritual content for you every day, so please come back soon. In the meantime, I wish you peace, prosperity and progress in all you do, with blessings. <laughs>